Hey guys, it is Joshua, and I am still in Madison, Wisconsin, and I am in a neighborhood. And there is a highly favorited geocache here in this neighborhood. I see it as I'm looking outside the car. I think this is a clever, great place to hide a geocache. It's very large. I got a bunch of travel bugs. It's going to be a major travel bug drop. Come with me. Let's go check it out as you join us for this geocaching adventure. <laughs> This geocache has taken me to a nice little quiet neighborhood. A little different than the other ones in Madison, which were downtown. This is a geo library. You know, guys, reading, reading, it's a good thing. It's important. Aw, little free library. Take a book, return a book. Okay, you can open this and look. I love it. I think this is a great idea for their neighborhood. I think every neighborhood ha should have a little library, a little on your honor system. The question, though, now is where? Oh, where could the geocache be? What's this do? Up oh, more books. Books. What's up here? Oh yeah, see? Ooh, that's the magazine section. Very nice. No geocache though. Oh, wait a minute. What is this? Ooh, let's see if this very well could be the geocache. Ooh, wait a minute. That's not it either. Huh. That's not the geocache. Guys, I don't know what the geocache is. So guys, this is confusing. This is a one difficulty, one terrain cache. It's called the Geo Library. It should be here. I don't know where it is. I looked all over this thing. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait just a second. After further investigation, I look behind. Aha. Uh -huh. What could that be? Could it be possibly, maybe? Ha <laughs> ha. I found it. The geocache. Logbook. And it's huge, guys. Look at Look at it down there. It's huge. We've got travel bugs. We've got more travel bugs. Well, I'm gonna sign the log, drop some travel bugs, maybe pick up a book. Thanks for watching.